video, we are talking about raw video. In a quick word, a raw image contains all the information from the camera sensor, such as contrast and sharpness, without processing and compressing. With a JPEG or a video clip, these informations are lost because it has been converted as a standard file. That's why it's normally not possible to do the same correction in video. Also, the compression in H.264 is too strong. The fine details of the edge are ugly, there is too much blocks from the compression artifact, and this is a nightmare, especially if you are like me, always adjusting the light and the colors in post-production. Lucky for us, there is a team of developers who created a plugin that you can install on most of Canon cameras. Here, a short list of things that were non-existent and very useful, but are now present on most of cameras from today. Zebras, sound level, focus picking, histograms. The principal function we are interested in here is the raw video recording capabilities. First, here is a comparison between a normal video clip and a Magic Lantern raw video file. You can see clearly a huge difference and a gain in quality. Make sure you are running the firmware 113 or 123. If it's not the case, I refer you to this quick and dirty tutorial to downgrade your camera. Make sure your battery is fully charged. Get the SD card empty, whatever is the capacity, it's fine. You'll need a fast CF card for the raw recording, at least 1000 speed. For affordable options, I also put a reference in the description below. I personally use the computer cards. Download from the website of Magic Lantern the corresponding firmware. I mean the one that is matching your camera. Also, install the last version of the application MLV app for Windows and for Mac. Three simple steps. First, copy the files into the SD card, switch to manual mode, and go to your Canon menu to start the upgrading. This will sort of hack the camera, don't worry. Now you can reboot your camera by turning it off and on, and from now, when you want to access the added function of Magic Lantern, just click the trash button. I will quickly pass in review some of the menus. Here, you can add more elements on the screen, such as an histogram and a zebra. You can also deactivate others like this one. Ok, go to the module section, because we have to activate the raw recording light, raw play and raw sound. And now restart the camera. And that's it, we are almost ready. Go to the movie section and choose raw. Click OK with the set button. With the Q button, you can select different resolution and ratio, but I'll explain more of that in another video. For the moment, let's just select the easiest configuration that will allow you to record continuously, such as 1080p and 16x9. Adjust your exposition to the right, make sure nothing is blown up, adjust the focus, hit record. Keep in mind that there is always a small delay of less than one second before it's actually recording. Also, it's better to limit yourself to 20 or 20 seconds per take, as the files can become quickly heavy and after you won't have any more free space in the car to shoot more videos. Now what to do with the files? Your video are the MLV files. First, you should copy them to your computer for better performance. Launch MLV app and import your MLV files. From there, you can do minimal or strong adjustments like white balance, exposure or shadows. You can also copy settings from one shot to another. This is similar to what you do in Lightroom. And if you are familiar with LUTs, you also have the option to apply one as well. You can also apply a curve such as a Harry log if you are a fan of the flat look. In the end, you get a better quality, a sharper image and a cleaner color contrast. The purpose of this video is to show you the easiest way, and that is to render as video clips like QuickTime if you are on a Mac, and start your editing with the software of your choice. You can of course export your MLV files as a DNG sequence and make the color processing from scratch in your favorite software like DaVinci Resolve. I will demonstrate how I do in another video. Thank you for watching and don't hesitate to ask me anything.